Today we're going to be feeding this colony of ants some flightless fruit flies. But before we actually do that, I have to go and catch this worker which happened to escape. Right, listen here, I need you to, yep, there we go, and boom, gotcha. All right, it might be a little bit difficult to, it's very difficult to see. There's a lot of fruit flies in here. are going to get eaten by this colony of ants. And as you can see inside the nest, there's quite a lot of them. All right, so I'm just going to tap the flies down right now. That way they're not like exploding out of this thing when I try and feed my ants. Okay, we're good, we're good, and they're kind of like starting to fly. I don't know how these guys learn how to fly. I can fruit flood and make a great protein source for your ants, uh, which is why I love to use them. Okay, so like looking inside the outworld, we can see that this, some of the workers have actually started to catch the fruit fly. But yeah, no, I think it's really good that these guys actually love their fruit flies. The fruit flies are super easy to breed, and they're super easy for the ants to catch. I want to say that's maybe like uh, 50 fruit, uh, fifty to 100 fruit flies, and it's definitely more than that. Now, the common question for me is, uh, why do I keep ants as pets? The truth is, I actually raise them so that I can eat 